Hello everyone, this is Diane and you're watching Lady Die Saves. This is a savings challenge video and I say a savings challenge video because I'll probably need to do more than one because I have gotten myself into so many savings challenges. Uh, if you hear some thumping noises in the background, that is my daughter doing her piano lessons with headphones on. So. Uh, sorry about that. We've got to use the, our time <laughs> and this is the only time today I have to film. So let's get into our savings challenges. As you know, this really nice scripture savings challenge is from Lindsay at Little Helpful Files and I just love it. Um, I learned last month that I do not have the money my ambitions were more than my money. <laughs> so each letter is now going to be only a dollar instead of three dollars. So I've got my money here. Uh, actually, let's count it. Let's count what I have for savings challenges. I have 20, 30, 40, 50, 5, 60, 1, 2, three, four, five, six, seven. Sixty-seven dollars. Let's take the our first dollar for February going into my February scripture savings challenge. And the verse for February is John 4, 16. Whoever lives in love lives in God and God in them. Because God is love. I love this scripture challenge and I will be writing this um, Bible verse on a post-it note and sticking it where I can see it and I'm going to try to memorize this verse throughout the month. Hopefully it doesn't take me a month to memorize it and hopefully more importantly I live it. I don't just read it, look at it, post it up, or even memorize it but I need to go a step further and live it. So that is the scripture one. This one I am going to unstuff. As I said in my last video, this one's complete and I'm actually ending this one because I just can't afford to do all these. I won't be able to do all my savings challenges. So in this one, we saved 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 5, 75, 80, $95 and I will do this maybe next year it is so beautiful it is by S Gus designs and if you love plants this is a fun one to do for a monthly savings challenge so I will save this to put in future savings challenges so then my next savings challenge is January I mean, this is the January one I finished. It is February we're doing, and this is from Lisa at Lisa Grateful Me on uh, YouTube and on Etsy. She is the Happy Mailbox Co. I had such a hard time remembering and saying her Etsy shop correctly last, uh, my last video. I don't know what was wrong with me. So, how much should I, make these. For this month, I am going to go super low and I will adjust it for next month if I feel it was too low and I have more money because I have so many fun savings challenges to do. So for this month, let's just go very conservative and make it just one little dollar because you know what? Dollar power! Every dollar counts. It all makes a difference. I learned that from Michelle at Michelle Free to Fly. She inspires me so much. She educates people on her videos and she has really educated me in cash budgeting and saving and she helps me feel so good when I feel like I don't have enough to do things. You know what? The power of a dollar. She says if you only have a dollar, then stuff that dollar. And every day, every time you stuff a dollar, it adds up. So 
don't feel bad if you only have a dollar to stuff. Just stuff it and be patient and stick to it. Okay, we've got a pink pretty flower now. So if you have not seen Michelle Free to Fly, go check out her YouTube channel. I'll put a picture up in the corner. I, I just love her so much. She is so helpful and she is, her videos are like teaching videos. I just love them and they're fun and she's so creative. So there is my monthly challenges stuffed. Boy, that was quick when I only have two going now. Next we have triple play monthly and we are on February. This of course you see the little bee is from two sister bees. I love those sisters. They are so fun. And let's get a blue for this one. So today we are going to use my darling little pink dye from two sister bees. And roll for Feb. Whoops. I'm not counting that one because I dropped it. I'm going to actually roll it. <laughs> oh, I like to use, I like the sound of it in this. So here we go. Six dollars. Ooh, we got the big, we're a big spender today. Six dollars going into, oh wow, I wasn't ready guys. Let me grab, I'm so glad they're close by. Grab my little notebook. Go to my, oh, time to take that out. Oh, so glad that's done. January no spend. Six dollars is going to go into my triple play. And you know what time it is since we're doing a two sister bees savings challenge. We need to do a two sister bees companion cards. And you know I have joked about up to now that these are the highly sought after hard to get <laughs> companion cards. I broke my no spend January getting these cards. Uh, let me tell you, and I didn't care. So, but now they did a video and they are producing them um, with some help. So they are going to be a little bit less expensive. I believe they're gonna come in their own little box and they are highly sought after still, but not hard to get anymore. Yay! Go get yourself some companion cards to use in your savings challenges. They are so fun. And because they are not going to be handmade individually, taking so much time from uh, April, uh, I believe that they're gonna cost a little bit less too. So anyway, let's pull a card and see what we get. Ooh, $5. Put $5 into your next savings challenge. Watch your savings grow. Woohoo! Okay, set this here. I need to write a six. Six dollars going in, went in to triple play. Alrighty, my next savings challenge is my $1 savings challenge. I need to give this one a little bit of love. And I'm going to complete it today. This one has been so fun to do. This was the very first savings challenge I ever did. Uh, the, this um, tracker is from Quaint Prince Boutique. I love her stuff. They're so cute. I've got my little pack of stickers here. These stickers are probably 20 years old or more. I bought them when I was doing scrapbooking, uh, creative memories, that dates me. So I need $10 in here. One, two, three, four, five from the companion card and one, two, three, four, five from my money. And sorry, I have to straighten it. It's just a weird thing. So $10 going in to, I needed ones for something, so I exchanged the money going into my $50 savings challenge. And let's use these cute little stickers and finish this off.
So if I did everything right, there better be $50 in here. Let's just count it and see. 10, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Yes, another completed savings challenge. I might use this for my grandson's uh, savings challenge that he made me. So this will be set aside for future use. Yay, that is complete. Let's put my companion cards off to the side. And now, next thing I'm gonna do is my change. I only had, where is it? Where is it? Here's my change holder. I made this cute little sweet but sassy thing. I only had 51 cents in change this week. So, I'm going to color my change tracker. I think we need another pink. Change tracker complete. And you guys, the coffee I had today, it's making me shake, but it doesn't seem to be giving me energy. But it didn't, it didn't help me in coloring, that's for sure. So, 51 cents going into this neat little change jar. I found this at Goodwill last December. Um, this change tracker and challenge, I call it my tracker, but it's also a 52 week savings challenge, is from Tracy Monster Savings on Etsy. I just love her trackers. They are wonderful. So, for this one, I am going to put in uh, two dollars and I'm gonna move it up to no two dollars and twenty cents I'll get the twenty cents out of my wallet so hopefully I have twenty cents in here five ten fifteen er twenty Two dollars and twenty cents going in to Penny Savings Challenge. I think this one uh, is from Reinventing Renee. I didn't write it on there, but love this. So this one I need to color eleven little spaces. Let's get the coloring. Penny savings challenge complete. And I am not having coffee before a day of coloring. I went out of the lines on, I think all of those. <laughs> okay. 52 week, $1 savings challenge. This is also from Tracy Monster on Etsy. We will, oh, let me put this in my cute little envelope I made. I don't think the coffee helped me today, guys. I am just jittery and I'm putting the change. How I decided to do this was put the dollars in the envelope and the change in my change jar. This uh, coffee is not helping me. It's just making me jittery and shaky and foggy brained. Ah, one dollar savings challenge. So now I use my one dollar and go to my one dollar savings challenge. I love these envelopes I made. Makes it so much easier. And color a dollar and try really hard not to go out of the line this time. Oh, I'm 
ones. Stay in the ones. Try it if you need to. Ah! Shit! Turbo, what is wrong with me today? Ah! One dollar. Week four completed. That was the best I could do, guys. I'm shaking from this coffee. Week four completed. That was the best I could do, guys. I'm shaking from this coffee. Okay, next we have 100 envelope with a twist. This is from Lisa Grateful Me. This is designated for Marshmallow, the puppy that we would like to get. I really would like a Pomeranian, but you know what? After I got this cute little card from Louise, I'll insert a picture of it right here. I'm I'm starting to wonder if maybe I'd like just any old white fluffy dog because I just like white fluffy dogs, so it might be a Pomeranian, it might be another other kind of white fluffy dog, but that is the goal. Today we're just going to do two dollars. We got to fill in these lower ones and this is a good lower amount week for me. Oh, so here is my envelope. I made this box took me forever to make but it was so fun so two dollars going into my 100 box challenge oh let's get this in the frame I'm gonna have to get a bigger box because it's not gonna fit all in this I love that uh, Lisa made this because the regular 100 envelope challenge is just a little too high of amounts for me. Well, not a little, a lot. <laughs> so this one is beautiful. It's colorful. And I can still participate in doing the 100 envelope challenge using this one because it only goes up to 25. But I have to say, I did learn from Michelle that, you know what, do what you got to do. If it takes you three weeks to fill in one of the envelopes, just color a part of it and keep track. Erg, I still went out the lines. I'm trying not to. There you go. Two colored. This is going to be so pretty when it's all filled in and colored. Okay. Um, oops, I forgot to finish uh, fill in my tracker for my quarters. This cute tracker is made by Jamie over at Jamie's Realistic Life. I love her trackers. She has several low income ones, which is helpful for me because I'm doing so many savings challenges. And I love that I can track all my quarters, nickels, dimes, and pennies with her trackers. So there's one, and I should have used a different color because I have that same color right there. Oh well. And two. Yes, go check out Jamie's Realistic Life. She has some neat trackers, neat challenges, and I love watching her channel too. Two quarters colored in. Okay, we have arrived. See this bracelet? My grandson found out about my YouTube channel and he watched and he sent me happy mail and he sent me a bracelet to wear in my videos and he sent me trackers and savings challenges that he made. Isn't this amazing? So I didn't catch this at first. When we go visit them every week, my daughter has such a heavy hand when she knocks on the door. She just literally goes bang, 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 bang. <laughs> and so he said, it's SWAT. So it's the SWAT team when uh, my daughter, nicknamed Cheyenne, knocks on the door when we go over there. Um, I need to ask him how I'm supposed to use this tracker because it has four spots. One, two, three, four. Um, maybe it's, yes, I think I mark it off when I play this. So this is the tracker for this savings challenge game that he made. So let's start with this one. This is the savings challenge for Marshmallow, the puppy we want to get. So I am, I need my quarter because this is a flip the coin savings challenge. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So I flip the coin, let it fall where it wants to fall, and I save that amount. Okay, here we go. Oh, 
that's close to 10 so it is going to be 10 bucks for marshmallow today that's a lot oh that's okay this is what it's for marshmallow here's my marshmallow envelope and here's my ten dollars going into my marshmallow video i mean video my marshmallow envelope thank you brown eyed boy i love your idea and you're helping me save money for a cute little puppy so we have played and we're only going to play one time today because 10 bucks is a lot so how will we mark this let's mark the pet shop and i'll just put a nice big heart over it that we played one time and we're gonna have to play this a lot with four spots so next time will be the house area wow that was great now here's the second savings challenge game that he made for me he thought it would be a good idea that um, I do a savings challenge for him save up the money for a year and give his the money to his mommy at Christmas time so that he can buy a Fitbit. <laughs> so this is for him to get a Fitbit and we will save the money and give it to his mommy at the end of the year. So I'm to take my die, roll it and whatever it lands on, that's what I pay. So it looks like it's $8. And you know what? I don't have an eight. I don't have enough ones. So guess what? We're gonna add two more and give it a 10. I need to get an envelope for this. I don't have an envelope yet, but I will make one. Or brown eyed boy, maybe you can make a piece of paper with a design for an envelope for a Fitbit. Draw a Fitbit on it and I'll make an envelope out of it. So let's mark off our very first F. We'll just scribble that in. So, first time playing the Fitbit Savings Challenge for my brown-eyed boy grandson. And I'm telling you, he must want nice things because $300 for a Fitbit? That's a pretty nice Fitbit. I'm not sure if we'll make it up to 300, but we'll do our best. Okay, that is all for this savings challenge video. Boy, it was a good one. Played some new savings challenges, finished two savings challenges, finished them out, and we'll have more in another savings challenge video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you are watching and you have not subscribed, please subscribe. It helps my channel and be part of all my shenanigans here. <laughs> and hit the notification bell so you can always know when I post a video. And I'll see everyone on my next video. Bye.